Hello everybody and welcome to Sophia the Traveller. This is something a little bit different for today. It's a, like a hidden object game uh, by Mimo Gogo and Thermite Games and apparently it has a little bit of a story to it. So uh, join me in not finding stuff. See how quickly I can find it. Probably not very quickly. Okay, so Sophia is travelling to Venice apparently. So let's have a little look. So, Alright then, so Mike always likes to hide with Sophia and he is hiding again behind the van. Yeah. Let's see him. Hurrah! That was like fairly easy. Uh, Sophia is there. Yeah. Hooray! Uh, apparently we need to find a cog. Um, and Mike's bone. And... A parrot. Okay. So these other things are a little bit more difficult. Uh, can I move around? All oh, right, you can move around a little bit as well. Okay. Cool. Most of the stuff though seems to be within there. Okay. You get a magnifier every six minutes. Okay, lovely. So I can magnify in. Right. So what I am not seeing at the moment is the bone, the cog. Can I turn things around at all? No, it doesn't look like it. I think that could be a bone. No, there's a chest there. Ah, okay, you can open chests. Right, good to know. You can make the cat's meow. Wonderful. I mean, I'm slightly concerned I'm not seeing a parrot. Like, where would that be hiding? Oh, that's the settings. <laughs> oh, Sophia here. Oh, you get you get clues. He likes to stand on trees. Well, he's not standing on any of those trees, is he? Haha! I see. You can like make him come out of the tree, right? Well, that's not fair. Good job. He gave me a hint. So the the bone was apparently in a drawer. So let's open the drawers. So it is interactive. Yay! Interesting. Okay, so I want to go on a trip with my microphone, Polly, and my beloved guitar. Oh, my microphone, Polly, and my beloved guitar. So she's gone to the library. She's looking stuff up. She's looking stuff up. She's decided where to go. Hurrah! Right, so Mike enjoys too much food. We've got a chest there. Always open the chests, I guess. So these are starting to get a lot more complicated now. Many, many cats. Many, many cats. Right, so we found her anyway. Uh, let's see. I opened that chest. We can open the sewer grate as well. Interesting. There's a chest there too. There's more drawers. Guitar's over here. Let's poke around in the trees for the... Parrot. Yeah, there's some cats in the trees. Oh, these look like areas where things might be. Like hiding behind them, maybe. Oh, there's the parrot. The bone has fallen into the grass. Okay. <laughs> That's kind of hilarious. Oh, you can make the flowers grow. Oh, I love this. I love the cool extra things you can do. No, we won't do that again. Unless I accidentally do it. Get off that pot. You look like Tilly. A bit. <laughs> I still haven't found Mike, though. Know? Where's Mike gone, like? Seriously? Where's that dude? 
What's it got to say? He enjoys too much food. Look inside there. Knock down the steps. Hidden amongst something. Hmm. Where's Mike's bone? That fell in the grass, it said, didn't it? Yeah. <laughs> the elephant flies. It's Dumbo. Well, I feel like I've looked everywhere in the grass. Oh, maybe it's in this grass down here. No. Okay. That would make more sense, wouldn't it? If you click on that and the bone fell out. But no. We're never going to find the bone. Oh, there's a sleeping cat we're supposed to find as well. That one, I think. Oh no, it's not that one. It's a different one. It looks like that one, but it's meant to be sleeping. Check in the tree, that one. Okay. The bone. Hmm. Still not found it. Oh, we can zoom in a bit. Okay, cool. Zoom in. We can also zoom out. Which might be useful for a good overview of things. Can't we, we can't move it in any other way too much. Uh, how have I not found an entire dog eating a bowl of food? Like, that's kind of crazy, isn't it? Who knows where it is? I bet it's not me. I'm like extremely surprised. Oops. I cannot find Mike. Is this where he's like in a tree or something? You watch. You see more inside here. No, I'm certain Mike isn't there. He's, he's gone somewhere else. That's what it is, clearly. He's absolutely not in this picture. Yep. <laughs> well, happened. Look all the birds move. A cat came out of the sewer. Oh my goodness, okay. Where the earth is Mike? It's like, he's really hungry, I yeah, know. Where is he? Oh, I can open those doors, okay. You really click on everything, don't you? Right, so now we are left with only Mike's bone to find. Okay, we can do this. We can do this, peeps. It is apparently in the grass somewhere. But I don't know if that's like throwing me off. Ah, there it is. In that grass. Is there more to find? Oh, good grief. Yes, there is. <laughs> well, I found that cat. And I know where that is. It's in the drawer. Ah, uh, the hat. And uh, see, I've, I've been slowly looking at things as I've been going, right? So now we need a cuckoo clock. Yeah. 
is up there and then we need a pot with uh, flowers on it there's a few pots around but not one that looks like that that'd be hard in a in one like this that's a that looks similar but like that one. Yeah. yay okay cool and then we're looking for a book Apparently not that book, despite the fact that book looks very similar. Maybe that book? Nope. There are many books around here, but it's not the one, apparently. There are so many books. Any of the drawers? Nope. What about these drawers? Secret book? Anywhere in there? I really like this actually. I like the way it's so interactive. Like, Mike literally wasn't there because he was behind a door. Yeah. yeah. All right, we, we managed that within a reasonable amount of time. I think I need to learn a little bit about the, the game and how it works because it's like, oh yeah, there's things you can open and there's things, that you, there's doors you can open and you can look in bushes and all sorts of stuff like that. So it's not like your standard Where's Waldo or Where's Wally if you're in Britain. And you're just looking on a static page and it will be in the open. Uh, it's interactive and things can be hidden in things. So anyway, we live in such a big world. As long as I'm on the road each day, we'll be even more precious. Sorry, each day will be even more precious than the last. Okay, so Sophia is now on her journey. Taking pictures. She's got Mike with her and the parrot. Mike's a little seasick. He's sleeping in his cabin. All right then. How would we, how would we find him in his cabin, I wonder? Where's the bone? Mike can't find his bone. Polly might know something about it. Okay, so, Polly Parrot. There's a golden key we need to find. I, I'm going to start with some of the people that it wants me to find, actually. I think that might be the easiest thing to start with. So let's have a look for Blonde Lady. Not seeing a Blonde Lady. Waiter? Do we see the waiter anywhere? Someone sitting on a chair. I see a waiter here. Oh, he has the roast yeah. chicken. So we found that at least. Right. Is there another waiter somewhere then? How weird, people are saying hello to me. How very odd. I'm wondering if we can go inside. Yeah. I didn't even know I was supposed to click on that one. Oops. There's someone being a detective. There's a man in a red coat. There's a teddy bear somewhere apparently as well. Haha, -ha, there's more boats. Well, that would make sense. That would be why we can't find all the people. There's a guy surfing. There's a guy swimming. There's a shark. Oh, no, it's a dolphin. There's a polar bear. Please don't tell me. Please don't tell me I don't need to find the polar bear. What? You kidding me? Oh, my goodness. How many boats are there? <laughs> There are so many! Okay, so I want to find another boat that's got a waiter on it. I mean, this is clearly the party boat. This one also, I think, has a waiter. See yeah. there? Cool. So this is going to give me a lot to chew on. I've got a lot to look through. Someone being a detective somewhere. Man in a red coat. But I've yet to find... Uh... <laughs> Where am I going to find a key? 
on the fishing boat. She left a key on the fishing boat. Well, that makes a lot more sense. There might be a key in here somewhere. This is a fishing boat. A little flap there. No, doesn't open. A lady with a briefcase. Are there more fishing boats than one, though? That's a tiny boat. There's another fishing boat, I think. It's got nets on it, so... Yeah. At a quick glance, I don't see any keys on that one. There's like a third fishing boat. <laughs> I haven't even found Sophia yet. There's like a fourth kind of fishing boat. I'm figuring anything with nets on is a fishing boat, right? Right? Maybe not. To open all the doors on all the boats because Mike's in this cabin. Oh, there's the key. Yay! Sharp eyes found 20 targets. See, I've got an achievement. See, I'm not terrible at this, right? <laughs> Polly somehow got covered in plants. There was definitely like a ship that was had loads of plants on it, like here. There's quite a few plants here. Apparently we can start the car. Wonderful. Yeah. I had a feeling there was a guy with a camera somewhere. There's a guy with like a massive beard. I'm trying to remember what all the people look like. But it's hard to remember. There's a guy juggling plants. There's a detective. There's a teddy bear in a deck chair. There's the camera. There's a guy painting. I wonder if we could find the guy painting. It's going to take a bit of time, isn't it? I'm seeing what jumps out at me. Is that Sophia? Yeah. yeah. Okay, so Sophia's on this boat. Which says to me that Mike might be nearby. But we don't know where Polly is. But Polly might know something about the bone, apparently. So. I'm getting well into this. <laughs> There's the guy with the three plants. There's the artist yeah. guy. Uh, we need the teddy bear in the deck chair. Teddy bear in a deck chair. That won't be that difficult to find, right? Unless he's literally in. There's a bear. On the game. On the game. Okay, what a weird bear. Um, there's bears in a plane. But no teddy bear in a deck chair. Four, now, four, That's what we're trying to look for right now is teddy bear in a deck chair. Anyone see the teddy bear in a deck chair? No. I am not seeing it either. Let's go. There's a witch. Yeah. There's a teddy bear in deck chair. Yeah. Right. Now what we're looking for? We're looking for wine man and detective man. And red-headed lady, man with a big beard. Still looking for Polly and the bone. 
Okay, so we're getting there now, I feel. I feel. This is like a, you know, quick 10 minute puzzle. <laughs> Might take me 15, actually. Mostly because I can't find Polly, though. Polly is somehow covered in plants. There are so many plants in this that Polly could be behind. It's crazy. Gaze to find Polly in them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I love I love that guy having a bath. Hola. I feel like Polly would be somewhere nearby, but Polly can fly, so maybe not. Don't trust. I've tried all of those ones, I think. I've tried all of those ones. I've tried that. Don't trust. You can click on the nets and put things on the nets. That's hilarious. There's yeah. Polly. Right, so Polly might know something about the bone. Uh -huh. Right, so we found Polly and the bone. So we found Sophia, Mike, Bone, Polly, Key. Let's look for a blonde lady in a pink skirt. There we are. Let's look for a lady with white hair. And a black coat waving. Sometimes it's just easy. I find it hilarious that I haven't found the people yeah. and I found things like the key. <laughs> okay, looks let's look for the man in uh with a massive bushy beard sitting down with a red top on. Okay. Not there, not there, I don't think it's there, I don't think it's on that one. They're all stood. Uh, there. Yeah. Okay, that's that guy I found. Now we need the red-headed lady. Dark skin, red hat. Okay, uh, white and reading a book. White suit. Reading a book, okay. I do not think she's on this boat. The problem is, like, that's it's such a big list, I can't see all the list at once, and that makes it a bit harder as well. But she is sitting down. Which makes it probably more likely she'll be on one of the bigger boats. Have a good look at this one. We still need the detective and the man with the... Other than that, we're good. So it's the detective and the man with the wine. And that lady that's sitting down. Let's see if we can find any of them. I don't think so on that boat. Or that boat. Just at a quick glance. 
Don't think they're on that boat. The detective might be hard to see. I've not yet seen the man with the wine either. Go on that one. There she is. Yay! Right, man with wine and detective now. The way they're facing does help as well. Gosh, there's a lot to find in these. It's definitely, like I say, very interactive. Let's zoom in on some of the boats a little bit more. It might help me a bit. Man with wine is difficult because he stood up. That's going to be a hard one, I think. I like differentiate him. Konnichiwa. Konnichiwa to you too. Flying the plane. Zoom out a little bit now. See what I can see. A couple of guys in hats here. There's like a. No, the detective will be turned around the other way, so. And that rather fetching red suit should stand out to me, I would think. Okay, blogging. They'll be hidden on one of these boats, probably. One of these bigger boats. There's a man in a fetching red suit, but not quite the right one. Okay, let's have a really good look at this boat. Had a couple of the guys from here. I feel like that's a no. Of course, we need to be looking behind doors. There's a chance that a detective might be behind a door, isn't there? Oh, there he is. Yeah. Right, so now we're just looking for the man in the fetching red suit. With his glass of wine. Glass of wine says to me, like, party boat. One of these. This is La Party Boat. They are drinking wine on this boat. Aha! Yeah. <laughs> okay, I really enjoy the feeling of discovering beauty and capturing good memories at any time, anywhere. Wow. Okay, so we are at the docks now. <laughs> I hope I'm not taking too long to find these things. Like I said at the, the beginning, I'm not I'm not the greatest. But then finding it is the whole thing, right? Sophia would eat lots of fruit during her travels to make her happier. Are there any like fruit stalls here or anything? Just having a look at the general area, see how far it quite big quite quite a large air area to check out here um this is like if where's waldo was five times the size wow uh really yeah i think i see waldo <laughs> Oh, 
Okay, fun times. Polly the parrot really likes being on top. <laughs> I'm thinking like on top of here maybe. Haha, <laughs> found you. <Yeah. laughs> Hilarious. Something to do with fruits. You need the clues in this, right? Mike is on a trampoline. Well, I'm so glad. That's so helpful. There's a special cupcake for Betty. It's a little big. There's a big cupcake somewhere. A football that's nearly rolled into the water. Oh, uh, someone's lost their purse. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Dickie is working on his paraglider on the roof. Well, the roof's easier to, to see people on things on. So maybe that would be a good place to start with the paraglider on the roof. Yeah. yeah. Why did I have a feeling that would be a thing? I didn't even see it, but I was like, that'll probably be a thing, right? We have a lot to find, don't we? Wow. The rainbow is not there, only there when it rains, it's there when the sun is shining. Mr. Clown thinks watering his head will not only make the flowers bloom, but make you smarter. <laughs> There's a boat going by as well. With stuff on it. Close his curtains. I can't open them again though. Oh yeah, I can. Oh, they're so in love. It's like, oh right, okay. They're, they're, they're so in love. Um, yeah. Do you know what makes me feel better is like, um, you get a magnifier every six minutes. I've done three puzzles in like sort of half an hour. So I feel like it's not like actually too bad. Yeah. Sometimes you just click on things that stand out and it's like, okay, I've got that thing now. Wonderful. There's a football that's almost rolled into the water. So how about we go along the water's edge and see if we can see a football anywhere. Uh. Yeah. Okay. Somewhere around there's a rainbow. I've got a feeling it'll be like painted onto a wall somewhere or something along those lines. Could be a tough one. Maybe one to find while I'm looking around for other things. Haven't found Sophia yet. Or the guy paragliding on the roof. I don't know like quite how fruit is a thing. There are many cats near the church and Anne likes to play with them. All right then. Church is like over here, isn't it? That's the church. So apparently Anne will be around here somewhere. There. Yeah. Cool. I want to find all the things where like there's a vague... Make the flowers bloom. Alright, is there anywhere where there's like a load of flowers? There's church. There's a few flowers here. Wonder if the clown is here. Not seeing him. Flowers up there. I don't know if the flowers is a a bad clue. Oh, 
All the doors are what? All the doors open. Oh, all the window shutters open as well. Good grief. What's I looking for? A flamingo? Two rats holding a pizza? Someone's satchel? Martin's watching the signage carefully. It's not safe for him to leave his backpack on the ground. Anywhere with signs? Still not found this rainbow either. Well, I don't have a feeling that the, the pizza rats might end up being in the sewer. But is there, is there like a pizza place around? Because if they stole a box of pizza, it'd be from a pizza place, right? You definitely gotta treat this. Like a mystery. Like you gotta <sighs> Sparks is so handsome when he plays his flute so seriously. Might we hear the flute being played? The duck is very timid and he's wearing a helmet. Well, that's wonderful. Violin performance in the crowd. Oh, so who, where's there a violin? Right, there's definitely a violin playing around here. So it'd be in this violin crowd, probably. There he is. Yeah. Cool. And somewhere around there'll be a flautist. Let's listen. Piano. Guitar. Flute anywhere? Haha. Yeah. Selena's dog loves to play. Can't find his way to the square and asks a passerby. Where is the, where is the square then? What counts as the square? Is that the square? So that's going to be a rough one. There's a girl dancing with a bear. We haven't found the rainbow, we haven't found the clown. We haven't found the frisbee girl. The flamingo. Ariel loves her flamingo swimming laps and wondering if she can swim in it. So it might be by the water somewhere with the flamingo. Might even be on the boats. There was a big boat going past at one point. That's a guy in a hot air balloon. Well, the boat's not there anymore, so I'm figuring that maybe the boat wasn't a thing. Cheers. There's a flamingo. Cheers. Clearly not the flamingo. But it does answer the question about whether flamingos can be... Um... 
yeah i probably will be going past things as i go but i'm trying to like focus on one one or two things at once oh there's the yeah. some couple For someone as unobservant as me, I think I'm not doing too awfully. There's going to be a couple of things that might be quite hard on this one. That dog is amazing. There. Yeah. The mice and the pizza? No idea. They're going to be difficult, I think. The rainbow shouldn't be too hard, unless it's hidden in a really odd way. I've still not found the clown. Anything else we need to find? There's a satchel. Some guy with a satchel. I'm like, really? I'm supposed to find a dude with a satchel. Jasmine's luggage was scattered all over the floor and she's very upset. Dicky is working on his paraglider on the roof. I think let's try and find Dicky in the paraglider. There's a, literally a robot up there, that's hilarious. Well, I think the paraglider should stand out, but also there's less stuff on the roof. Well, there is actually a reasonable amount of stuff on the roof. Ah. Three. Why are you crying? Well, it's a bit difficult to find Dicky in the power glider. Hmm. On the roof. I've not not seen him yet. Which is really surprising because I've kind of checked out all the roofs. I think anyway. Ah! Yeah. Whoa! That was a lucky one. Are you kidding me? You have to click on the guy to water his plants. The rainbow isn't even there. Man, this is a hard game. <laughs> There's a robot up there. Still no dicky in the paraglider. I always find things when I'm not looking for them, don't I? <laughs> Honestly. Maybe the pizza rats will stand out to me. I don't know. Let's have a look for them. I feel like they would be in some of the more foodie parts. I'm also worried that they might be down a sewer grate. There's the cinema. Oh look, that's a, a, a pizza chef. He's cutting up pizza there. So do you think the rats might be here? Oh. That's her luggage. <laughs> uh, I feel like the pizza rats might be around here because we're close to the uh, place where there's pizza. Are there any like Rates outside. Opera singer. Give me Cornetto. <laughs> oh man. I think I'm gonna finish the video after this puzzle though. This is too this is like insane. Let's get you busy for hours. Yeah, anyone thinking that they want to play this? Be warned. The problem is you've got to open like every window. 
But this guy with his glider, I feel like should have been way more obvious. So it's clearly hidden somewhere, like that, for example. Every window is openable. <laughs> Suit of armor, someone's shoes. I'm amazed I found the things I have found. That rainbow, I can't believe it. The clown watering his head. They don't give you any clues as to where he might be other than something to do with flowers so there are flowers there there are flowers in here i do not see a clown watering his head Hey, it's Teddy in the de in the deck chair. Cool. I love finding things from other puzzles. That one literally has a lion in it. My goodness me. Okay. There's Yay! the guy's backpack. Wow. As a foodie, it's easy to feel happy and satisfied. Oh, I found enough stuff. Yay! Uh, maybe, apparently, I don't have to find everything. <laughs> Wonderful. Okay, let's carry on. So, Sophia's gone to the hotel room and found a magic genie lamp. Right, so Mike was hiding in a little corner somewhere. Does it tell me, like... Oh, okay, so there's a map of it. That's good. I can take, like, a, a photo mode. Oh! We can go back. Uh, no, I don't need to do that. Let's go back into this one. In fact, how many levels are there? I need to know. <laughs> there are, after this one... One, two, three, four, five more. Oops. Let's uh, let's just go in and play. So that one is like partially done. Oh, I see. Because we never actually found Sophia or Mike or anyone, but it unlocked the next level. So I'm like kind of happy to just look at the different levels. Reset the game as well. So you can go in and like try and finish ones that you've partially done later on if you want. So let's go and do this one anyway because it might be a bit easier than that big one. We could maybe come back to that big one later. Um, so Sophia is invited by Aladdin's lamp to play along. I see. In any of the drawers. Yeah. Right, well, there's one thing. There's the lamp. I don't know if the lamp would be a thing. There's that guy. Yeah. There's yeah. Sophia. Yeah. Mike's favourite bone. Mike was hiding in a little corner somewhere, but his tail gave him away. I see. Yay! This bone will probably be in like a drawer somewhere. I don't know. You open these little drawers. Not in the fridge. Not in those drawers. 
I'll look for his bone later. His bone's tiny, so it's hard to find. There'll be other things easier to find, like the parrot. Polly Parrot seems to be hiding well. Yes, Polly Parrot is hiding well. In the painting. <laughs> okay, so uh, I find it easier on these smaller ones. That massive one, that was rough. Yeah. That was really rough. Someone's tiny shoe. Oh, is that all we've got to do? Anyone want to buy this vintage leather shoe? So we've just got to find the leather shoe and the bone. There's the bone. Yeah. Right, vintage leather shoe. Where are you? Everything else was fairly good. Gosh, I can't believe that last level, though. That was insane. Trying to find the clown with the thing on his head and all that stuff. My goodness. I think this shouldn't be too hard. Like, the vintage shoe. Who knows if anyone's going to buy this vintage leather shoe. It could be on people's feet. Couldn't it? Check everyone's feet, make sure that the shoe isn't there. No. So, is anyone going to buy the shoe? <clears throat> uh, so tiny. There. Yeah. That was rough! But that was a bit... Yeah, that was like a little five-minute cute puzzle. The meaning of travel is to be able to meet your true self. So where's Sophia off to now? On the gondola. And Mike has met a poodle and run away. And Sophia is trying to find him. And she went into a pizza restaurant and got a pizza. Wonderful. Mike found a lady he was attracted to and followed her, I guess. So, Sophia is at the Central Plaza enjoying yeah. pizza. This is another massive one again. Gee. So these massive ones, I'll just do as much as I need to progress and then uh, I might come back to them later if I have time in the episode. Mike found a lady he was attracted to and went upstairs. Where's the pizza restaurant? Delicious cake, coffee, restaurant. This is a restaurant, and Mike was upstairs apparently. Can we open windows here? No. Can we open in on that side? No. Can we open that window? Yes. I don't know if that's the pizza restaurant. I maybe should have paid more attention to what it looked like. Oh, there's a fruit stall over there. How interesting. It was left on the street. The bone was left on the street. That's super helpful. Oh, there it is. <laughs> oh, so funny. Right. Polly thought the mural would suit him. Hmm. <coughs> Excuse me. Polly thought a mural would suit him. Where's there a mural then? Looking for a mural, not seeing one anywhere. Like a big convent sort of thing there. I don't know if I got you anywhere. Nah. Okay, let's see what let's see if there's anything else easier to find. 
Shirley is a pig in a dress. Warren is blowing up a balloon really hard. The detective hides behind a tree and watches the market. Yeah, it's that guy. Yeah, of course I'm seeing all the things I shouldn't be seeing. So there's the market, hid behind a tree. Well, that's the market, right? I'm not really seeing him, like, sticking out anywhere around that marketplace. Maybe there's another market somewhere. I haven't even found the pizza restaurant yet. Mr. Pumpkin is interested in the building. In the square. Leon is dancing to Michael Jackson in front of the restaurant to pray tribute to him. I see. Seriously, birds in a nest? Would they be in a tree somewhere? Or we'll check all of the trees. So I don't even know what the square counts as. Like, it's like everyone's in the square. Is this the square? It's very hard to work that out. It seems more bustling and busy there. I looked like Sophia for a second, but it wasn't. Couture, hotel. I'm gonna check here upstairs. But I know Mike said he'd gone upstairs. I need somewhere. The witch there. That's the same witch that was flying on the broom. I love how all the characters like reoccur. I'm doing terribly on this one though. Miss Mermaid was very careful, didn't want to be seen easily. Oh, that would be the square. Okay, who is in the square? Guiding a team in the square. Seeing him here, though. Oh, the Maraca dancing bear guy's here. There's another marketplace. I don't know if it's like the main marketplace. Apparently, the detective was hiding behind a tree watching the market. There's literally a goblin. Oh, there's that guy. Cool. So this is definitely the square then. In front of the restaurants. The restaurant is up here. There he is. Uh, sunflowers, a rooftop full of sunflowers. Looking for Jenny. And to like watch. Oh, there, Jenny in the rooftop with the sunflowers. That was a nice, easy one. The yard by the church. Is that the church? This is the church. In the yard by the church, there should be some turtles playing kickball. Well, that's technically the square, right? So is this the yard? Is this the yard? Why is there a fish in a tree? Uh, 
I think it can be sometimes quite hard to categorise things. So I want to see more about where our main girl is. So... Yes, definitely. There's only one restaurant, I think. The restaurant in the central plaza. Yeah. That's cool up there. Here you are. I've probably looked at her like a hundred times already. I'm pretty sure the only restaurant I've seen is this one. I am not seeing Sophia here at all. And Mike was apparently upstairs. But I'm also not seeing Mike, which makes me think there's maybe another restaurant, but I don't see another restaurant. Rather annoying. Hello, panda. Oh, the flower drum. That is also a restaurant. Okay. I'm also not seeing Mike there. A hotel there. This is Venice. There's going to be loads of restaurants, right? Right. But this seems to be the main plaza. There's a dog, but it's not Mike. Problem is, it's too easy to get obsessive about these things, isn't it? And then you don't find anyone. But this is the first place I tried. But all of these people are definitely not Sophia. So Wayne's job today was to hand out flyers. Laura likes to warm her blanket on the roof. Sean looked for a bathroom in the Grand Plaza, but couldn't find one. Interested in a building. I mean, a mermaid sitting on a rock, right? In the water somewhere? Doesn't want to be seen. There she is. Well, I found her easily enough. See, those birds will either be on a roof or on a tree. I hate these huge ones though, like they, they are really difficult to deal with. Because there's just so much to look. I was really hoping for like an easier one, like that little palate cleanser we just had. <laughs> so, that was nice. I like that one. That could that could stay. This one, get in the bin. Yeah. Oh, the guy blowing up the balloon. Wonderful. It was there the whole time. Oh, would this count as the market then? There's the detective behind the tree here then. Yeah, we found the detective. Nice. So that's a help. The yard by the church. A nurse treating an injured child. The east of the city. Reading books in the house. Oh, grief. Barbecue on the roof. A vampire on a high place observing humans. Oh, okay. Let's see if we can find a, a vampire on a high place observing humans. 
That place is super high. Okay, that was clearly not the high place though. I need to find a vampire in a high place watching humans. There was supposed to be people like someone sunning herself on a blanket or something. Like that is the highest place. Yeah. The church is always the highest place. I don't think I'm going to find that person, sadly. I don't know why I haven't found the, the correct restaurant at the moment. That's kind of bugging me as well, as you can tell. Hello. 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 store with a coffee shop. Oh, there's a restaurant that says sirloin steak on it. Have a little look around and see if we can find Mike up here. Nope. There's a coffee shop. There's another dog who's not Mike. I just don't know why I'm not finding this restaurant. It's kind of crazy. Sam and his siblings having a barbecue on the rooftop. Maybe we could find that. Rooftops seem to be easier to look amongst because there's less stuff on the rooftops. Having a barbecue on your rooftop. There's the guitarist. Great. Mm -hmm. Rooftop barbecue, anyone? Why is it only rain there? Mm -hmm. That's hilarious. Which one knew where this vampire was? Yes. I found the key. Doesn't want me to find the key though, does it? The restaurant waiter couldn't find the customer. Oh, I know where Richie is on the roof. I've seen him a hundred times. Yeah. Clown, teddy bear, Santa in a bathtub. How have I missed Santa in a bathtub? <laughs> oh, that's crazy. How do you miss Santa in a bathtub? Yeah. I'm just going to click on everybody and hope that I find someone useful. Still looking for that like nest of birds as well. Like the more I look for something, the more it kind of like sticks in my brain. I need to find it. And then sometimes I just find it when I'm randomly looking around. Salute. Salute. Cool. It's too finished. Just trying to get any like leaves off the trees to find the birds. <laughs> there we are. Lawrence did work on the beach. Do we have a beach here? And now you're working under a tree. I didn't notice a beach.
There he is. Yay! Teddy likes to enjoy his vacations at the chimney opening. Let's click on every chimney. Oh my goodness, this place has so many chimneys. So many chimneys, it's not even funny. Oh, and a teddy bear who likes chimneys be. This is going to be another one where I don't even find Sophia. This should be like the basics <laughs> for this, but... It's like she's totally at the restaurant. What, what restaurant? Can you get a week? That's an exclusive attitude. Oh, there's a pizza restaurant. There's the wine guy. You lost the book on the stall by the square. Let me go through this a bit more. And find Sophia and just see. At the restaurant in the central plaza. There's an outside table. Ding, ding. Did the Michael Jackson dancer say it was Central Plaza? No, in front of the restaurant. At the restaurant. Hello. Sitting on an outside table, round table. That's exclusive at you. This table doesn't, this restaurant doesn't have round tables, you see. And the restaurant that Sophia's at has round tables. That one doesn't have. Around here has some round tables, though. But they all have umbrellas. I'm being way more detective y about this now. A single place that has like round tables at the moment. That place says it has sirloin steak. Mm -hmm. This has round tables, but again, they have umbrellas. I really want to find Sophia. Again, round, round tables, but no. Put umbrellas on them. So Sophia needs, oh, we need a round table that doesn't have any kind of umbrellas. But I don't think we're going to find her. Delicious cakes make me hungry. I think if we find Sophia, we find Mike. Yeah, 
I want to go back, right? And what I want to do is have a look at the... Uh... Oh, no. Done that one. I want to have a look at the introduction because the introduction kind of showed me... So we came onto the docks. We went into a place that does pizza and has round tables inside. No, it really doesn't. Mike found a lady he was attracted to and went upstairs. So they kind of came onto the docks at some point. And then Mike ran away. Trying to see if I can get some clues as to where they went from that. Okay, there is a round table up the top here. At the very top of the pizza restaurant. But that so far is the only round table I have found in the whole place. So I kind of feel like looking for Sophia is just gonna be a nightmare, honestly. Place has round tables. Don't think if I've just not been to a certain part of the city or something. Sun, sun garden, sunflower garden, which we found earlier on. Yeah, I'm really irritated not to be able to find this place with the... Um, let's have a look at the map, actually. So we can go to certain places by looking at the map. Round tables in there. But it's like I feel it should be the restaurant. So I keep looking there and it's not. Oh, I need to look for something else. Laura likes to warm her blanket on the roof. This is getting it's getting boring now, uh -huh. I know, because I haven't found anything in ages. Pig in a pink dress. I'm just never gonna find that unless just randomly. Let's have a look around. Aha! Right! In the Grand Plaza. Is 
There should be a little boy. Yay! See, as soon as I don't try to find Severe, I'm fine. Mr. Pumpkin, we're never going to find. Is it? I feel like this is the yard by the church. But it might not be. The pig was in the central plaza, right? Oh no, it never really said where the pig was. Oh, that's where she is. Yeah. So you get a mag... Oh, I've got four magnifiers that help me with her. Okay. So if she's there, and Mike's gone upstairs, apparently. Then Mike will be in one of these windows, probably. This could be interesting. Gosh, Mike. Why is he in no Mike? I think Sophia really helped. Right, let's see. Aha! Right, there's Polly with the mural. Wayne's job was to hand out flyers, but that didn't seem to go well. Laura likes to bl warm her blanket on the roof. And then we've got Mr. Pumpkin, and I think I've found everything else. Except for, like, loads of stuff. Oh, the guy with the flower flyers. Okay, let's see. What else I can maybe find on my own? I wonder if we can find Laura on the roof on our own. <laughs> Probably not. I am not surprised I couldn't find that one. And the two turtles doing kickball. Oh, there's Mr. Pumpkin. All right, we, we've done enough on this. I am well done on this. I'm going to see what the next one is. Right, not too big this time, so I think we'll be okay. It's the huge ones that's, that I struggle with, the massive, great big ones. Right, so I see Sophia straight away. The bone. I do not see. Where might Mike be? Mike is learning to appreciate the exhibits as well. Okay. Polly has a pirate hat on. There's Mr. Pumpkin. There's that blonde guy. I, I'm getting better at this as I'm getting practiced, I guess. Butchie. Blonde lady in long white skirt. Not seeing, we'll come back to. Wizard. Yeah. Lost dinosaur. Hey. 
Polly the parrot. Mm -hmm. Um. Yeah. Hi up always helps me. Mike's boom. We might ha we might have to find that with a thing if I don't, if I can't find it before. Right, let's see if we can find this lady, and the, then we'll see if we can find the dinosaur. So, looking at any blonde head people. She's when I'm coming back to you, so... Hi. Yeah. Is that you? Yeah. <clears throat> now we've just got to find Mike's bone. Could be anywhere. We're only three and a half minutes in, so we've got time. And we've got to find a little dinosaur. The baby's lost dinosaur. He must be very sad. Right, so now we only have Mike's bone to find, so if we can't find it in the next three seconds, we can just use a magnifier for it. <laughs> Let's just see if I can do it without, though. It would be ideal if I could keep magnifiers to even maybe go into the... and finish off the previous... Oh, there we are. Perfect. And I think that that is all we have time for today so i hope you enjoyed this little look into sophia the traveler i'm sure there are more even more fiendish puzzles uh to be to be done here but uh this is as much as this is as far as i am going to take it because i think uh, if we go any further it's probably going to end up getting too fiendishly difficult and it might be a bit boring to watch so I hope you enjoyed what we did do. If you did, then please do leave me a like below. If you'd like to see more of this type of thing, then please subscribe. I'll let you know when the videos are out. Hope to see you next time. In the meantime, please look after yourselves and keep being awesome.